Well, hi guys, in this video I want to show you how to use a macro overally and uh, in our case we focus on GTA, how to use it in this game, but uh, I will try to make it general and make it a tutorial for making and using macros. <laughs> Well, uh, for using macro, the type that I want to show you is uh, AHK, uh, which you need to download the uh, auto out key. Uh, I will uh, put the link uh, for this uh, website to download auto out key in the description for this video, and you can uh, easily download it and install this program. Uh, this is a free program. Then, uh, when you install this program you can uh, make uh, macros with it uh, how to make it uh, just uh, right click on the desktop new and auto hotkey script then you will see a uh, f uh, prof uh, file like this uh, which the, uh, the uh, that's uh, ahk uh, the format of this file uh, you can just edit this uh, file and put your macro in it but how to how, what is the syntax of the macros well uh, for doing that uh, there is a good website which I will uh, put that uh, put the link of that website in the description too this website this is really good for uh, syntax of the macros and more about them how to uh, coding the macros but uh, this is a bit hard at first to try uh, uh, programming a macro for yourself and maybe you want to get something uh, uh, really easy and just use it well uh, for that I will put two macros for you guys uh, to use it but uh, for uh, customizing these macros I will show you how to customize your macros uh, one of the macros is uh, for mine and the other uh, which I made for my friend I will put both of them uh, now I will show you how to uh, uh, customize the macro then I will show you how to use it in the game for customizing the macro just right click on it uh, edit a script this is the format of the macro first of all you have a script about the uh, things that you want in the game for example in GTA uh, for example the chat spam is uh, a slash or back a slash and uh, sniping and spamming is left out for me uh, if you want to customize it you can change it for example I can make it to Q and the uh, Q will be the button for me for uh, uh, spamming uh, snipers or uh, for uh, uh, for uh, skip the reloading thing and this is just important for uh, adding your uh, key bond to your macro then the next part of the macro is the hotkey you must uh, describe the hotkey for example a sniping uh, is uh, here a sniper a spam this this uh, this name is important and this one because uh, when you want to uh, describe the uh, macro you must use this one then the th th third part of the macro is uh, describing the macro describing the formation of it and uh, for example here when you come here it's uh, a sniper spam this is the exact name when uh, we used in part 2 the halt key a sniper spam but here it can be changed uh, a sniper spamming for example if you can make it like that and it's not important it's not uh, important but uh, you can use it uh, like that uh, but uh, I prefer to use the same name everywhere because uh, you might uh, get uh, a bit uh, uh, disturbed uh, with uh, changing the names well uh, here it's a sniper spam uh, send means uh, a start of the macro uh, we'll uh, use uh, number 5 and number 9 which uh, for a sticky bomb and for a sniper and then return it will do the uh, spamming with the sniper and all of the things are are the same for example for chat spam uh, send T will uh, uh, like it's like uh, pressing T then uh, double space dot double space dot then again uh, enter which uh, pressing enter then again send T uh, for the four space and two dots and it will be the format of the chat spam and I will put this uh, <coughs> macro for you in the description the next next macro uh, which I will uh, okay, I won't 
I won't save this because I don't want to change the formation of this. The second macro is my, uh, I made it for my friend and uh, the numbers are with numpad. And uh, you might uh, say, okay, uh, not this one, uh, this one. You might uh, you might say, okay, you you want uh, you can change them. Uh, but uh, what is the, for example, the number for right click or left click? Then I showed you a website. With this website, you can see the bottom, uh, for example, X bottom one is uh, side keys of the uh, mouse. If you have the side keys on your mouse, uh, or R, R button, it means uh, right click, uh, and L button, it means left click. And even you can use it for your, uh, your joystick, your controller. For example, here, you can name your joystick to your uh, macro and use a controller and a macro for it. Uh, well, uh, till now, I showed you how to edit a macro or even uh, put new things into your macro and change the things here. But now I, wa I want to show you how to use it in a game and how to activate a macro. For doing that, it's really easy. Uh, when you uh, start your game, for example, for me is GTA, GTA right now, just uh, double click on your macro. And when it's working, it's like here. As you can see, I have two macros right now. Don't use two macros at the same time. It will uh, get uh, disturbed and corrupted uh, like that. Just double click and you can see your macro is running. You can uh, pause the macro or exit it, which will close the macro for you. Like this, you have the macro and it's working on the game. On many, game, uh, on many uh, videos, I, I've heard that uh, they said uh, use the uh, window mode, not full screen. But uh, actually, it will be, it's working with uh, full screen uh, type of your screen too. It, it doesn't matter if you are in window mode or full screen mode. Uh, both way will work for you and you can use your macro in the game. Uh, well, when you have the macro, you can use the key bonding which you prefer for that macro and use it in your uh, online uh, experience or any kind of games, for example, single player, it doesn't matter which type of game you have. And you can use them in uh, var various games. Uh, it's not like that for just this macro, uh, uh, it's useful for GTA Online. You can use it for any kind of game, but remember, uh, you must change the key bonding uh, due to the keyboard key bonding of that game and your key bonding. For example, uh, let me show you the macro once more after this. Uh, for example, number five is a sticky palm in GTA and number nine is a sniper in GTA it, in default form, which mine is like that. When you change your uh, sniper to uh, button, for example, uh, number three, you must make it five and three, not five and nine. It won't work for you like that. And uh, you, uh, in the second uh, macro, I put the uh, fast re respawning for you guys. Uh, and it's really useful. Uh, for example, uh, when you press uh, uh, left alt, uh, it will uh, goes to a sniper and uh, a sticky bomb for you. And you can spam a sniper. Uh, well, hope you have fun with this uh, tutorial for using macros and having fun with it and this is important if you are a PvP player uh, for example you can fast respond uh, BST and other things and it will give you an advantage in your fights you will have the time well uh, subscribe and like this video for more contents like this and I will see you guys in next videos bye bye I'm so mad, 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 I'